while knitting and recording. That is Classy's. Oh no! That's a, you okay? Yeah, it's fine. Did it spill? No. I mean, yeah, but whatever. Yeah, hello, hello, how's it going? Hello, um, welcome to the first episode of my show, uh, I guess I haven't picked a name for it, Knitting, Knitting Time with Willie. That's a Fine. great name. Is it though? I think it's pretty good. Oh, Tells shut you every <laughs> That doesn't sound real, I'm sorry. I like to have reality. So, Okay. yeah, let's get knitting. Okay, great. What you knitting? That's none of your business. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, uh, so this is the show? Well, it's knitting time with Willie. I'm knitting. I don't know. It, 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 okay, so it is with knitting time with Willie. Well, I guess I'm hooked to it now. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'll change it in the overview. It's a working title. I mean, yeah, a little peek behind the curtain, but I haven't recorded the intro yet, even though it was seamless. Oh, wow, okay. So, so, so yeah, maybe I'll change it, but right now it's knitting time with Willie and I'm knitting. What are you doing? Great. Um, watching you knit. That's true. I should probably ask you some questions, huh? Sure. Um... Okay. Oh, I Googled some icebreaker questions earlier, so I'll use those. Uh, Google's a great uh, website. <laughs> really? That's what I brought my first guest on my show. And the beautiful input that you're giving me is Google is a great web. Yeah, you know what? I love water too. It's a great drink. The fuck kind of. Yes, Google's a great website. So, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. with that in mind, uh, what was the best piece of advice you were ever given? That was Ooh. one. That's the only one I can remember. Um, the best piece of advice I was ever given, um, don't go to sleep angry. That is a good piece of advice. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. Well, I can't sleep angry, personally. Right? It's hard. I feel like when you get really angry and, like, you really piss someone off, you, like, wake up like it's a hangover, kind of. Yeah. And you're, like... An emotional hangover. Yeah. So, um, okay. How has that impacted your life? Uh, I try not to go to sleep angry. That's funny. I've never seen you angry. Yeah. So, but I've always seen you sleeping. <laughs> yeah, always. So, <laughs> I guess you're... I spend a lot... I try and spend more time sleeping than I spend angry. But, uh, you know... Yeah. In 2020, plenty of stuff to be angry about, but you gotta you? just... Sorry, before I bed. was bored with your answer. So you <laughs> um, are working in videos. You work in videos. I work in videos, yeah. But you don't show your face. No. So do you, you probably don't have any tips, because I'm sweating like a bitch right now. Oh, yeah, same. Um... Because you I, have to turn the fans off when, because you don't want to mess up the, the audio. So and I made the I made the mistake of having a show where I've committed myself to wearing a sweater. Um, <laughs> yeah, I saw you put that on, and I was like, oh man. Well, I thought that with, how hot is it in Willie's apartment? I thought with like um, a knitting show, knitting time mm -hmm. with Willie. I thought that a sweater would be like a nice. Um, a nice, uh... I don't like the way it feels to right? be sweaty. Right, it's gross. Yeah. I don't understand how cavemen did it. Although I'm seeing <laughs> a lot of uh, documentaries these days that say, uh, cavemen 
did have air conditioning. How's that? I mean, not a lot of documentaries, but, like, one, and they were basically, like, they, they kind of, um, they were just better at, uh, and and by cavemen, I mean, like, Romans, but Mm. they, um, like, angled, they uh, they angled their buildings better. The palm fronds, that's Egypt, I guess. They did the palm front. I think that's just cartoons, kings. I don't know if that (laughs) people actually did That's not a real thing. I don't know, maybe, but, um... Actually, you know what? I'll be right back. Um, I'm going to go take off my sweater. I'm not wearing pants. One second. Okay. (laughs) Did I just hang out? Nathan, keep talking. You're on camera. Okay. Uh, uh, Willie is going to take off his sweater right now. I, I saw him put the sweater on on camera. I don't know why he had to go away to take it off, but... I get it's it's like that thing where you go to take off like a sweater, but then it, it sticks to your shirt and it looks like you're taking off your whole. Nathan, I'm back. You can stop the damn thing. Okay. You work in media, you'd say, right? Yes, I work in videos. I work in media. Yes. And so with the shifting um, landscape of yeah, media. Yeah, I knew you were gonna say landscape. Hell yeah. So do you think that if you watch the video from the ring today, the little girl would come out of your phone really tiny. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Or do you think she'd have to stick her normal size hand through it and just kind of like grab at you? Oh, and she'd have to like really squeeze, like squeeze is, through. Is it saving that's... us or is it making us stupider? Wow. I, you know, I don't know the the logistics of how she gets out of the screen. But I do, you the the image of a tiny little ring girl coming out of a phone is it's delightful kind of cute, to me. right? You kind of yeah, want to put her in your so pocket and save her. I hope that's, yeah. I mean, it, you know, and it also opens up uh, the door for like a lot of cool horror imagery. Like she crawls like into your into your nose or something and like starts hecking you up oh, from the inside. Oh, that's a good point. See, I was, so you're saying she could Ant-Man it. Cause she I was could thinking. Ant- yeah. Oh yeah. She could do the, the Ant-Man crawl, crawl inside you, but, and then get big. Yeah. The maybe, thanus, maybe she can do that. What the internet called it. Thanos is a combination of Thanos and anus. Um, wasn't the wasn't there like a recent ring sequel or reboot where it was like the ring video was playing on every little TV screen on an airplane? Probably. I remember. I I have that image in my head. I, think, I don't I mean, know. They did if a I... reboot called Rings. I don't believe that it was very poorly received. Actually, Ring Two also a very bad movie. I remember seeing that in theaters as a kid, and it ends with the little girl. Hmm. Uh, trying to crawl out the well, and she goes, Mommy. Right. Mm-hmm. And then the blonde lady goes, I'm not your fucking mother, and closes the well. Which just seems mean. Yeah, it's like she was trying to kill you, but, but she was you don't have to like, be mean about it. I feel like, do you ever see the movie We Need to Talk About Kevin? No, I'm not a big horror movie watcher, That's not actually. So I mean, it's horrific, but it's less of a horror movie. It's a it's a psychological like a, thriller. Is that um, what we call it? It's about Tilda Swinton is like a mother who hates her child, mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. it's kind of like, is she hate her child because she's evil, or is the child evil because he hates, sort of, she hates yeah. her child? Anyway, he goes on a school shooting, um, and I feel <laughs> like Nathan, please be perfect. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. So Tilda Swinton was right to to hate her child is yeah. is so, the no, moral of the that's, movie. That's the question, and I feel like we need one of those for the little girl from the ring, because okay. she was in a well. That's not good parenting. No. I don't know how she got there, but I think it's Did, probably they they put her down there, right? Because she was evil. See, I think that's the case, but I'm basing my knowledge of that on Scary Movie Three. Yeah. Which is a great movie. It is. It's the best of the scary movies. How many did they make of that? Like 18. I think they're still going, and they kind of started a trend. Oh, no. Are my boxers visible on the camera? Oh, well. Your what's? My boxer briefs. Are they visible? Yeah. I can see them. You can see them? Well, you're not supposed to be... 
you don't have the same camera view as the audience does. Oh, okay. Audience. Uh, this, is, this is a more behind the scenes. Huh? Yeah, yeah, this is a BTS. Well, um, we'll see how I edit this. And by me, okay. I mean hopefully someone else. <laughs> um, Gotta get someone else to edit your videos. I, That's true. I'm trying to think. I mean, none of us would survive on a desert island, but I feel like you'd at no. least like you'd at least have like a thing that you could provide. Would yeah, be, I could like, draw. You know, you could draw pic it. pictures of people's corpses for their family mm -hmm. to find them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or like cave paintings. Remember cave paintings? I do remember cave paintings. Do you think that if you were more of a caveman? Um, you would cave, we would paint on a cave? I'd probably at least give it a shot, you know? If they, you would? if they had the, I wouldn't know how to make the paint. You Someone think? else would have to give me the paint, but I could, you know, I'd draw like a, a buffalo or a mammoth or something so on I, the, on the cave wall. Uh, pitch for a Drawfee episode, you guys rent a cave. Yeah. And then make some berries. And if we ever get out of quarantine, I I would love to do some like shot on location type stuff. At a cave? Were you cave? At a paint? cave? I do a cave paint, sure. And then would you do like a battle royale with the um, other three? What do you uh, What do you mean like by that? Like you're in a cave. Mm-hmm. And say the cave like collapsed in on itself, and only one what? survives. Oh. Would you Hunger Games them? Does that not make sense? <laughs> yeah, I, I guess I, I guess I would probably want to like check with a cave expert before picking a cave to film in. To what like, the fuck is a cave expert? I don't know. I don't there's gotta can, be. I there's gotta think, be at least one cave expert. Yeah, but I don't think you can predict caves. I think that they're very you can check, fickle. You know, check the 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 integrity, the structural integrity of the cave. Be like, hey, here's probably a safe cave versus uh this cave. Mm mm. mm. No good. Yeah, but like you could die at any moment, Nathan. That's true. You ever think about that? What are All your the thoughts time. on mortality? Um, you know, it's uh for it or against it? For or against mortality? Yeah. I mean, I guess. Uh, wow. That's a that's a tricky one. They should have put um, that in the icebreakers questions. Though. Yeah, that's yeah. a really good one. For or against? I mean, it's it's a natural part of of life is is dying. Uh -huh. So, in in theory, I guess for. But obviously, it's sad when people yeah. die. So. Yeah. Uh, okay. you know, try and try and do what you can to prevent death as as long as possible. Make it, it so that people aren't just, dying. you know, yeah. dying left and right like they <laughs> kind of are right now. Um, please don't um, date this. I don't Yeah, you're right. You're right. It's know. we don't know when My this is coming is out. Timeless and people are going to be watching this. This is Everything could be great by the time this comes out. You're right. I do feel badly for when people die not of corona. Yeah. Like, they weren't expecting that, for sure. No, they were busy thinking about other stuff. Probably, like corona. Yeah. Um, I'll be... No, I won't. My cat was eating my lunch, but now he's gone, so... Oh, what was your lunch? It was salmon, um, Nathan. It was salmon. Oh, but yeah, that's... Cat's gonna... Cat's gotta get in into that for sure. Well, my cat eats everything but his own food, and he has horrible uh, IBS. So when he does eat stuff that's not his diet food, he has horrible diarrhea. Wow. Yeah, no, I don't I know feel why. That. We, I don't know why we ended up him. Do you have diet food? No, but I, I mean, I, I get the when I eat stuff I shouldn't. I bad stuff happens hmm. in my body. I am terrified to see what a sweaty mess I look like right now. Um. <laughs> I think you look great, bud. Of course I do, but that doesn't mean I'm not sweaty. I'm okay, pulling yeah. it off. You're, you're absolutely pulling it off. Also, I think I might be going through menopause, but like as a boy, or oh, sure. as someone who would not uh, be born immune to going to menopause, um, right. I think I am. How does that, What what is, um, 
like what, I'm what's not involved in that period anymore. Okay. And you, um, were, were you no, were you before? But I'm also not having it. But you're anymore. also not anymore. Okay, got um, it, got it, got it. Got it. And uh, I'm really hot right now. Normally yeah. I need a popsicle, but we're out of popsicles. Have you ever done that thing where you uh, have a thing in your fridge and then you go to get the thing, but it's just the box? Oh, yeah. That happened with me and popsicles last night. That's a that's a self prank right it, there. It is a self prank, and there are lots of that's ways big... um, that it was good because I don't need a popsicle. Where are you going? I, something fell off my desk, and I wanted to make sure it wasn't like a living creature. It was just a, a an errant wire. Do you but have it, like, Do you have living creatures in your apartment? There are always living creatures in apartments, Willie. Oh, you insects. mean like it, oh insects? Well, insects are not really living. They're like I, I mean they they are they are. But I don't feel bad when I kill them. Oh, like, that's fair. Yeah. I feel like that's why I don't like mice. Because I feel like I would feel bad if I killed a mice. Yeah, anything with like a skeleton on the inside, it's there's yeah. just that extra. You can't you can't do a a, a, a squish is different than like a, a crunch, you know. Our uh, friends Brian and Emily, uh, they woke up with a rat in their bed. Oh, on on Emily's face, right? I believe it was, so. It was on Emily's face. Yeah, that's a harrowing experience. And you know would what? Not, would not wish that on anyone. Yeah, but the thing is, it wasn't in my old bed, because we used to be roommates, so if it had to happen to anyone, I was happy it was her. <laughs> um, but Yeah, you got out just in time. I really did. So have you ever had a rat on your face? I've never had a rat on my face, no. Are you sure? Because you have a beard. Oh... That's a good point. There could be little, there could be little, little baby there could rats. Be little, little guy. Let me check. No, nothing no. in there right now. But yeah, yeah. I guess that's it's you. The rat on the face. I guess I would hope that if there was a rat on my face, I would be sleeping soundly enough that I don't notice it. Because uh, then it's like you know, if a rat sits on your face and you don't wake up, did it really happen? Get away from my tea. Oh, kitty! No! No! Doodle! There's my cat, Doodle. He's trying to drink my tea. <laughs> Which is not actually tea, but, uh, the, the people Beauty. don't need to know that. Um, well, Wait, I what just is told it? them. It's wine. Nice! Right? It's classy. Wine's classy. Never... Wine classy. is classy. Tea cups are classy. So drinking wine out of a tea cup, I figured... Wine out of a teacup while knitting and recording content. That is classy as... Oh, no. That's a, you okay? Yeah, it's fine. Did it spill? No. Did you spill? I mean, yeah, but whatever. It's oh, did I wine. freeze? So, um, oh, no. have you been watching oh, internet. Succession? I know it's Why not do you new do anymore, this? but that's what people talk about now. Do you freeze? Uh... Oh no, right, me, There we go. We're back. You're back? My, my internet froze. I'm sorry. Oh, but that it, happens but to me all the time. Yeah. Um, we'll leave it in. We'll do we'll fix it in post. Yeah, we'll get we'll edit we'll either edit around it or it'll be like a real funny bit. Uh-huh. Uh, Especially cuz I got I did I said the funniest joke of the episode when you were uh not there. No, uh, I missed it. Um so anyway, have you been watching Succession? No, oh. I saw the fir I watched the first episode. Oh, yeah. I decided it wasn't for me. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know I've never it's, seen it. It's beloved. People wow. love it on the on the Twitter, and so I was like, I'll get. I gotta see what people are talking about, and I was just like, this is not. It's like they made Arrested Development again, but took out any jokes. That's true. Do you just hear that? My cat sneezed. That was a good, yeah, I wasn't sure what that noise was. That's was a great... cat sneeze. Cat sneeze. And he's uh, walking around all the electrical equipment like he's going to do something bad. And now he's just going to, I think, scratch my chair. Whatever. You know what? It's the first episode. Um, we're going to uh, get better and better and better. And then that's probably it. 
I mean, I think we're starting off from a pretty, pretty solid place, though, you know? I'm, like, starting to collect sweat on my thing, like... Yeah, that'll happen. It's bad. It's real <laughs> bad. Um, Is the ice pack doing anything for you, though? I mean, my butt's not sweating as much. That's good. Maybe I, I gotta try that. I gotta try the, the butt ice pack. That's actually, like... If, if anything, for me, the best thing to come from this is, is the butt ice pack Not idea. Not the lovely conversation you're having with a friend? I mean, that's, number, that's a solid number two after that. You son of a bitch. <laughs> I mean, the conversation I'll, I'll cherish forever, but, like, the butt ice pack might actually, like, provide a, a tangible life improvement for me. So will the conversation... Thanks to me, you're not going to die in a cave That's next true. to Jacob. Yeah, I didn't even consider that as a possibility until you brought it up. So I'm and that's why you're be... extra likely to die in a cave. You think yeah. people who think they're going to die in caves die in caves? No. No, no. You're a- yeah, absolutely right. Huh. <laughs> I need to figure out how the fuck not to sweat for the next episode. <laughs> I think more sweat. I feel like the sweat was sort of like the lubricant of the conversation. It like let us flow seamlessly between topics. That's disgusting. You could always, you could always come back to the sweat. I mean, it's like, sure, but that doesn't. Shut up! Fuck you. Um, can we curse on this? It's your show. <laughs> Can we curse on this? <laughs> you're the one making it, man. <laughs> Should I curse on this? Should, oh, you're asking my... Well, because yeah. I think I'm... You see my teacup full yeah. of wine. Yeah. I'm going for a classy vibe. And I know I that I'm naturally classy as shit, but I feel like saying fuck maybe, kind of pulls it down a bit. Maybe if you, if you pick like a real classy sound as the bleep for the curses... It'll be, um, okay, so I'll figure it out, I'll go fuck, 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 and it'll be like a French horn, or... Oh, yeah, a symphony. A symphony, oh, oh, um... A slide whistle. No, but you said some... Well, that's just silly. That's if I was going for a clown vibe. Clowns are classy. Clowns are not classy. Clowns are monsters. What's Stuff making... I don't... Stuff... Sometimes just like noises happen in my apartment, and I don't know what they are, and so I. Do we just catch look... ghost activity on um, on here first episode? Maybe. We already so decided that. So like, you don't have to care about mortality, because we become ghosts when we die, because you just proved it. There you go. So uh, even more reason to be pro mortality. You get to, if you got unfinished business, you just become a ghost. It's fine. If you were a ghost. Mm-hmm. Do you think you'd still have a beard? Ooh, a good question. Yeah. Do you think it yeah. would grow? Do ghosts have to shave? No, I don't think... I think it just sort of stays. I think it just sort of stays as... as is. So you think that, like, like when you die, God is, like, a cartoonist who, like, picks, like, your, like, most generic look? Mm-hmm and like one outfit that you wear every week for budget reasons. Yeah, you sort of become like a, a cartoon character version of yourself. Does that mean that you can like survive an anvil? I guess you could because you're- it, If you're already broke. dead, yeah. I mean, what are, what's a, yeah. What if, what if like all cartoons are just ghosts playing out in the other world? Yeah, 